These may not be the ideals of the founding fathers of the People's Democratic Party, the PDP. Since losing its first general elections in 2015, the center of the party can no longer hold. But a founding member of the party says all is not lost yet. Uh, we played a critical role in ensuring that we talk to everybody. We even suggested talking to the wives of the people involved, um, the parents of those involved, so that we appeal even to, on a personal level that we should not allow this PDP to die. Chiroma, who is a member of the People's Democratic Party Board of Trustees, says for a peaceful and harmonious development in the party and the country, women cannot afford to ignore all that involves the art of governance. She maintains that because women bear the brunt of poor governance, it is incumbent on them to rise to the occasion and contribute their quota and ensure sustenance of peaceful coexistence within and outside the party as well as the general society. According to her, the role of women in governance should transcend party leanings as she calls on the women of the other political parties to support their husbands and sons in their respective political career for the good of all. Nigerian women, we should be very conscious of governance because if government is steady, then the women are happy. If government is not steady, then the, look at what is happening. The women are bearing the brunt of what is going on. So. Even in the other parties, the women should be involved in peacemaking, in ensuring that there is progress in the party and in governance, good governance in particular. The PDP has been entangled in a leadership tussle between the National Caretaker Committee, led by Senator Ahmed Mohamed Makarfi, which emerged from the March 21 non-elective convention in Port Harcourt, and the Senator Ali Modu Sharif Kam, which maintains that it has the mandate to lead the party to 2018. Osaitin Osadebame, Core TV News, Abuja.